Hey everybody, Roy Isaac here from Saskatoon, Saskatchewan. You're watching TJV Trucker Josh on YouTube. Absolutely, it is a good morning. We're here at the Flying J in London, Ontario, and we're gonna get moving today. It's Saturday. I could do the whole thing tomorrow, but I don't want to risk it because I have a 5 a.m. appointment on Monday morning. So I'm gonna go a little ways today as far as I want to, then I don't have very far to go tomorrow, which is Sunday, and then I can get a good sleep and be at my customer for 5 a.m. the next day, and I'm not gonna be late. Thinking, see? Always thinking. So I'm fully reset now. I took a day off, I didn't film anything yesterday. Just got all my videos up on Patreon. For those of you who want to see them early, they're there early. Uh, the whole week is up there. And then I release them one at a time on YouTube. So if you wanna see them early, they're over there. Link is down below in the description of all my videos to that. Uh, it's patreon.com slash TJV. But if you don't wanna do that, you can watch them right here every day. And uh, let's get to trucking, how about that? Let's get to trucking. Been sitting here long enough. Off we go. We're going to be crossing from Sarnia, Ontario into Port Huron, Michigan. And we're about 900 kilometers away from our destination. It's 550 miles or so. We'll see how far we get tonight. We won't drive too late, otherwise we won't find a parking spot. Then again, Rock Island, Illinois is right across the river from Davenport, Iowa. So it's way on the other side of Illinois. So there is usually less traffic in that part of the state and usually parking at some of the truck stops. I guess we'll we'll see how we feel. I mean, it's, it's already like 2.30 in the afternoon now, so I don't think I'm going to be driving like way into the night. That'll mess up my schedule and it'll be hard for me to get up for 5 a.m. when I have to deliver on Monday. So I'll just go a few hours today, make it easier for us tomorrow.
Greater Detroit right now on I-696. Headed west towards Lansing, Michigan. Still don't know how far we're gonna go tonight. We're gonna go until we don't feel like going anymore. I could get all the way to my destination and then just sit there all day if I wanted to, tomorrow. Guess we'll just see what happens. Life is full of mysteries. Where will Trucker Josh stop tonight? It's one of those mysteries. We have no idea. But I just want to give a little shout out to Michigan here. Your roads actually aren't that bad. I'm actually pretty impressed. Like, I don't think I'm gonna need to stop and tighten all the bolts after I leave Detroit here. Like, this isn't too bad. Guys, I'm making progress. It's very nice. Making progress, I like it. Not the smoothest road I've ever been on, but hey. I'm from Manitoba, so it doesn't take much to impress me when it comes to roads. It's a beautiful sunset here. Not sure exactly where here is, but here is home tonight. <laughs> I've still got my pants drying all over the place here because they take forever to dry in the truck. Got to keep constant air blowing on them. Uh, for those of you who don't know and who care, there's one or two of you out there, I know. I'll let you know that I don't dry any of my clothes. Uh, I've had a bad experience, many of them, where my clothes shrink and then they don't fit. And I got mad, so I vowed never to use the dryer again for anything other than like socks and uh, other meaningless things. I don't know, I don't use the dryer much. I hang dry everything. Plus, I don't know, from an environmental standpoint, saves energy, right? Saving the polar bears. That's me. Told you I cared. Didn't believe me. One dryer load at a time. So I, I hang everything to dry. So in the truck, it's a little more difficult when I do laundry. So I try not to do it in here too often, but it works, whatever. It works. I should turn on the lights up here and close the curtains. We have shut down for the night. Uh, let me check to see where we are. Diesel, you know where we are? You know where we are, good buddy? Let's, uh... Oh, fine, you're out? Well, just because I sit down, you, you jump... That's kind of insulting, man. That hurts my feelings. Huh? He's got a little buddy, a few trucks down there. They keep staring at each other. I think it's a chihuahua or something. That's not lunch, Diesel. It looks like a little snack. It's like a little, a little cat almost, but he barks like a dog. I don't know. Okay, where are we here? Uh, there's a TA across the road. I stopped at the pilot. We are in, uh, let's just click right on the address. Pilot Travel Center. Uh, da, da, da. 15901 11 Mile Road, Battle Creek, Michigan. That's where we're at tonight. And I could sleep in tomorrow. I've got five and a half more hours to go right to the destination. And we won't be going right to the destination because I can't sleep there anyways. So we'll be going close by. So I'm guessing I've got about another five hours of driving to do tomorrow. And I've got to be there early enough so I can shut down and be at my customer for like 4.30, 4.45 a.m. because they want me there for five. It means I've got to shut down by like, let's say if I want to get going by like four, I've got to shut down by six. So if I got five hours of driving, I have to leave here by 1 p.m. So that shouldn't be a problem. I should be able to sleep in a little bit, get up, eat breakfast, have a shower, relax a little bit, stretch my legs, maybe go for a walk. Yeah, man, you heard that right. I said the W word. Oh boy, oh boy. Oh boy, can we take my widow buddy with us over there? Is he looking at you right now? Is he looking at you? He's down there in that white truck. Oh yeah, he's staring right at you. <laughs> I don't know if I can zoom in, the camera's uh, pretty bright right now. Little guy just sitting there, staring at him. Staring at him. Staring at you, Diesel. He's staring, he likes you, he thinks you're good looking. Maybe it's a girl, it's probably a girl. Ooh, Diesel's got a girlfriend. Man, come on, man, you're embarrassing me. 
She is kind of kind of pretty though. Look at her. Look at her. No, stop looking at it. Don't look. Uh oh, I think mom's calling. I'm gonna tell her you got a girlfriend. That is that is your mother. I'm telling her you got a girlfriend. <laughs>